Mongo, wake up! Uh, what? What is it, Mongo? Take a look outside, Vudo. This is not good. Okay, Mongo, fine. You had to wake me up. Our village looks totally normal. W wait a second. Why is there a giant red circle in our village? I don't know, Vudo, but look over here. There's two guards standing outside of the red circle. And look, Mongo, they're guarding a bunch of treasure. Uh, excuse me, guards. Why is there a giant red circle surrounding our entire village? For the next three days, you have to stay inside this red circle. What? We can't leave for three days? I guess so, Mongo. But if we can do it, then we get the treasure inside that chest over there. Whoa, really? In that case, I'm ready to start, Wudo. That's the spirit. These guards are going to keep a good eye on us, so we better not step over that circle. Now, how big is this circle exactly? The first building over here seems to be a library. Check out all the books inside. Then if we look over here, we can see our little house and wait, look, what is that, Wudo? That's a blacksmith, Mongo. And do you know what blacksmiths usually have? They usually have some really good items. We can take a look at it later, Mongo. But I think right now we should probably get some resources we have no idea what might come for us while we're stuck inside this circle. I'm just gonna mine some of the wood that's right over here. Then we can use it to make some brand new tools. Now that we have pickaxes, maybe we should start mining the cobblestone too. Goodbye, cobblestone floor. I need to use you for my tools. We're already making so much progress. We should probably start exploring what's inside these houses, Mongo. And they probably have good stuff. Ooh, ooh. Oh, you're right, Woodo. That's why I want to go to the blacksmith. Well, so do I. Let's go. I just have to open that door and oh, Mongo, this is not good. The red circle goes right through the middle. How are we going to reach that chest? I feel like you can reach it. All you have to do is stretch your arms like this and there you go. Wait, what? Your arms are super long and you're so close to touching that red circle, Mongo. Don't move forward, okay? All right, Wudo. I'm not gonna move, but I am gonna get everything inside of this chest. Check it out. I got two iron ingots. Oh, let's go, Mongo. You got iron? I'm not gonna use it just yet. What if we need this later on? You're right, Wudo. That is super smart. But now let's go check out the other house. I am looking forward to this one. It's a giant library, but it looks like it's been abandoned. And look, Mongo the circle goes right through this house again. Watch out, Woodo. There's a bat in here. Oh, no. Ah! I don't like bats at all. <laughs> Ew. Well, taking a look inside of here, Mongo, I don't really see anything. Are you sure, Woodo? Looking around the books, I see a lever. Wait, what? It's in the books? Where? No, not in the books, but underneath them. Check over here. Oh, Mongo, you have such good eyes. How did I not notice that? It was so obvious. Let me just flip it and whoa. Did you just see that? Yeah, it opened opened up a secret chest. I'm gonna try and reach over it, Mongo. Scoop back a little bit. Do not touch the circle, Wudo, please. Okay, come on. I'm gonna click it and whoa! There's a bunch of iron ingots in here, a bunch of bones. Ooh, scary. And last but not least, a turtle spawn egg. Is that Jimbledorf? Wait, Wudo, that's your pet turtle. Why in the world is he here? Probably because he's gonna help us to defeat this circle challenge? I mean, come on, Mongo. Turtles are literally the best mobs in Minecraft, and I wouldn't want anyone else but Jimbledorf here to watch us. Aw, isn't Jimbledorf so cute? He is, Woodo, but in order for him to live, he needs some water. I'm gonna make an infinite water source right over here so we can get as much water as we need. And most importantly, Jimbledorf has access to it, too. Aw, look at him in the water. How cute is that? 
that. But now we need a new home too, Mongo. That tiny house is just not going to be enough room. Hmm, Woodrow, you are right. And I have an idea. So give me your bucket. What's your idea, Mongo? To get some resources, Woodrow, we need to make a cobblestone generator. A cobblestone generator? I've never heard of that before. Well, it's okay, because I'm going to show you right now. All I have to do is break some blocks like this. About four long should be good enough. Then break a block inside of here. After that, all we need to do is place the water like this. And what do you think we're missing, Wudo? Oh, I know, Mongo. It's lava. And luckily, we have a bunch of lava over here. That's right, Wudo. So I'm just gonna grab some like this and go all the way over here and place the lava right here. Whoa, Jimbledorf, stand back. This is some dangerous stuff. And now, Wudo, we can just sit here and mine as much cobblestone as we want. Oh, that's perfect, Mongo. Now we can make a giant house inside this circle. And while I mine this cobblestone, I want you guys to subscribe right now. So do it in three, two, one, boom! There you go. Now you're subscribed. 999 and 1,000. There we go, Mongo. I just mined 1,000 cobblestone. That definitely took a lot of time, Wudo, because look, it's literally sunset. Wait, what? It's already sunset? I did not keep any track of time, Mongo. This is not good. We haven't even built our house and a bunch of mobs are about to come inside our circle and there's nowhere we can hide. Oh no, that's super dangerous, Wudo. What do we do? Well, Mongo, do you remember those iron ingots I had? Yeah, I remember. What are you gonna do with them? Well, how about I craft another bucket. And I'm gonna fill this bucket with lava. With this lava, we can go on top of any house and pour the lava right on their heads. That's super smart, but be careful not to burn any of the houses down, Wudo. I know, Mongo. I'll be extra careful. Come on, let's just go on top. Okay, Wudo, I'm following you. Wait, Mongo, watch out! There's already zombies here? Oh, no. That's not good, Wudo. That means we need to use our lava bucket. Come on, Mongo. Do you think those three little zombies are gonna do anything to us? But what if they start getting on the roof of the house, Wudo? The roof of the house, Mongo? What? Wait a second. What? There's a zombie here? How in the world did you know that zombies are gonna spawn on our roof? And wait, Wudo, do you hear that? There's a bunch more zombies down here. Wait, really, Mongo? I can't see. Uh-oh, uh Mongo. Um, I I think I just tripped and fell. No! That's not good, Wudo. I'm gonna join you down there. Watch out, Mongo. We can't step outside that red line. Otherwise, we're not gonna get that treasure. But how do we get out of this situation? The zombies are attacking me. Ow! We need to defend ourselves. Let's use the lava, Wudo. Okay, Mongo. I'm going up here. Come on. I think I got the zombies in the perfect location. And I'm so low on hearts. Okay. Okay, Wudo, let's just drop the lava on them. Come on. Okay, let's do it in three, two, one, go! Zombies, get ready to burn! And look at them. They're dying, Wudo. Oh my gosh, Mongo, you're right. Look! Get over here, zombies. You're not going to make us get out this red circle. Ha <laughs> ha! Check it out. It's about to be the next day. Wait, are you serious, Mongo? We did it. And because we made it past the first day, Mongo, I think everyone should comment hashtag circle. So quick, everybody comment hashtag circle right now. Now, Mongo, what should we do on day two? Well, I can tell you one thing, Wudo. Check it out. Our house is literally on fire. But what? Mongo, what's going on? Did you accidentally leave your lava there, Mongo? No, our house! We need to go stop that fire right now, Wudo! Come on, come on, Mongo! How do we stop it? Let me put this lava back over here and come on, water! Let's 
Let's go. Oh, oh, quick, I'm going to try and blow on the fire. Oh, oh, Mongo, this is not working. The water is super weak. I'm literally on half a heart. I need to get out of here. Oh, no. We couldn't save it, Woodo. The fire was just too strong. Oh, man. I like that house so much, Mongo. I really wanted to live in there. But now, because of you, we can't. It's not my fault, Woodo. I totally forgot. You know what, Mongo? It's okay, because I have a plan. I don't want any more zombies, creepers, or skeletons getting inside this circle tonight. So we need to make another bed that you can sleep in, because we only have mine over here. To make a bed, we need some wool. Where can we get wool from? Hmm, I don't know. Where can we get wool from? Uh, what? Wait a second, Mongo. There's a whole flock of sheep inside this cage. I think it was always there, Woodo. We just didn't notice it. It's outside of the circle. So how in the world can we reach it? Well, I did notice something weird, Mongo. Do you see this redstone? It leads right up to the circle, but we can't even do anything about it. I think I know a way, Woodo. To make this redstone go off, all we need is a pressure plate. If we just put the pressure plate right here, all we have to do is go on it. Wait, stop, Mongo, stop. You're not allowed to do that. It's on the circle. Quick, let me break it before the guards notice. What are you doing? Sorry, Woodo, I totally forgot. It's okay, Mongo. I think the coast is clear. They didn't see us. Okay, but how do we get those sheeps, Woodo? We can't even place down pressure plates. I think there's a different idea we can try, Mongo. Whoever set up this circle is obviously a trickster. So what if we just try doing a bunch of different stuff to the redstone. I can try to click it. I can try to tap it. Come on. Is anything happening? Mm, I'm getting stumped. Oh, I know, Voodoo. What if we try throwing a block on top of it? That would never work, Mongo. What are you talking about? Well, you won't know until you try, Voodoo. So all I have to do is throw it onto here and boom, check it out. It works. Wait, what? That actually works? I don't know what type of magic that that is, but look, Mongo, the sheep are coming. We need to lure them inside the circle, and luckily, there's a bunch of wheat over here. Let's grab it so they can follow us. Oh, sheepies, come here. I know you guys love your wheat. Yes, yes, yes. Haha, <laughs> I'm gonna kill you, Mr. Sheep. No, Mongo. We were gonna shear the sheep. What are you doing? Oh, I'm sorry, Wudo. And look, Mongo, it's a pink sheep. I can't believe we found one. Don't you know how rare a pink sheep is? Okay, Woodo, but we still need to get the wool from them. It's gonna turn nighttime very soon. Ah, don't worry, Mongo, because I still have two little pieces of iron ingots left, which is just enough to make some shears. Boom! Now come over here, Mr. Sheep. I need to shear you like this. And now look, Mongo, I have three pieces of wool. I can easily craft a bed just just like this. And boom, Mongo, there you go. Now I have the perfect place for you to sleep tonight. Right next to me. Let's go, Voodoo. Hurry up. It's already nighttime. Uh oh, Mongo, you're right. I'm already asleep. <laughs> Mongo, don't fall asleep yet. At least let me tell you a bedtime story. Bedtime story? Okay, I want to hear a bedtime story. Well, once upon a time, there was a king and a turtle who lived very, very happily inside the their Minecraft village until they woke up one day and they were stuck inside a circle. Ah, what kind of scary story is that, Woodo? It's not a story, Mongo. It's real life. Let's just go to bed, Mongo. I don't want any more scary mobs trying to kill me. Okay, good night, Woodo. <laughs> Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, it's morning. Yay. Good morning, Woodo. Good morning, Mongo. How did you sleep last night? Honestly, that sleep was amazing. I'm going to make us some breakfast because we deserve that after such a long day of troubles. How does some fresh bread sound, Mongo? Oh, bread. I love bread, Woodo. Make me some. Here you go. Nom, 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 nom. That was so yummy, Woodo. But I just noticed something even cooler cooler than bread. Look, Mongo, you didn't even notice. A pack of wolves came to our circle. Aw, aren't they so cute? We should try to tame them, Woodo. I want some pet wolves. Hey, little dog. 
Maggie's. How are you guys? It's the third day, which means we only need to survive just a little bit longer until we can get that treasure. Come on, please be my pet, Mr. Wolf. And I got my first pet wolf. I got one too, Mongo. Let's go and ow, what the hell? Um, Mongo, help me, help me, please. Bad doggy, stop hitting Mr. Wudo. Um, Mongo, does your wolf not like turtles or something? Yeah, I think he hates you, Wudo. Wait, what? Why? I didn't even do anything. Maybe he just needs some food. Here you go, buddy. Oh, okay, Mongo, if you say so. Come on, doggies. Let's go hang out with Jimbledorf over here and just relax because the day is almost over and we're going to be able to get all this treasure. Um, Wudo, I don't think so. Wait, why are you saying that, Mongo? What do you mean? Look behind you. Trust me, this is bad. Uh, wait, what in the world? Why is there a whole horde of creepers here? And, uh, Mongo, they're coming close to us. So what do we do? I don't know. I don't know. Just run around the circle. Come on, come on. I don't want to explode. Oh my gosh, that was so close. Yeah, there's still some left. Watch out, Wudo. Okay, Mongo, we really, really have to pay attention to where we're walking because if we step a little bit out that circle, this challenge is over. Come on, help me kill these creepers. There's so many, Wudo. What do we do? I don't know, Mongo. And ow! Oh no, oh no, this is not good. This is not good. I gotta build up high so I don't activate the creepers. Watch out. Our wolves are defending us, but I don't know how long they're gonna last. Since we're so close to completing this challenge, how about we make ourselves a nice fortified base? You Using all this cobblestone we got from our cobblestone generator, then no mobs will be able to get inside. We need to hurry up, Wudo. The creepers might still be coming in. And who knows what other mobs will come attack too, Mongo. I'm just gonna keep extending this cobblestone all the way out here. Oh, um, Wudo, look. It's about to turn nighttime, and I hear a bunch of mobs over here. Wait, what? Even more mobs? What could it be? And, uh, uh, Mongo, this is not good. Why is there a giant horde of zombies trying to kill us too? I don't even have any lava to kill them. Luckily, I have some, Wudo, but I don't know how effective it'll be. It's okay, Mongo. Just try it anyways. We still have our base over here. Oh, there you go. Most of them are dying, Wudo. And look, Mongo, even after killing all those zombies, there's still more spawning in. Does this mean something? Maybe, Wudo, but this is definitely not normal. Wait, Mongo, this isn't good either either. The house is on fire! You left the lava here again, Mongo! Oh, no. What's our only base? Luckily, it's nighttime. There's nothing else that can go wrong in a few hours. I mean, obviously not. It's basically almost morning. And, uh, wait. Mongo? What is that? Um, Wudo, is that supposed to be a zombie or something? It does not look normal. Actually, I think that's the mutant zombie, and it's just staring at us. What's going on? Um, hello? Do you want to just kill us and- ah! Uh, Mongo, this is not good. This is not good. This is not good. Watch out, Wudo. This thing looks super strong. We have to kill it, Mongo. That's the only way we're going to make it through the last day. Come here, mutant zombie. What are you trying to do to us? And whoa, check it out, Wudo. It already got killed. Let's go. I'm going to celebrate. Let's go. Wait, wait, what? It didn't die, Mongo. Ah! You lied to us, mutant zombie. I thought you were dead when you were laying on the ground. What the heck? Get away from me, please. And no, it's killing our dogs too. Get away from me, mutant zombie. You are not letting us lose this final day. Come on. How many more hits until this thing is dead, Wudo? I don't know, but it's still chasing me. Ah! This is not good, Mongo. But hey, look, the guards are helping out. And uh, wait, the guard just died, Mongo. What? We have to kill it before sunrise. Otherwise, we lose. You're right, Mongo. And look, the sun's about to come up. Come on, Mongo. It has to be dead now. Please just die, mutant zombie. And no, no, it came back. It came back. Ah! Don't worry, Wudo. I'm here. Kill this thing. Come on, come on. And oh my gosh, Mongo. Wait, we did it. We did it. We did it. We completed the challenge. Yay. Yeah. Ooh, let's go. Does that mean we get the treasure chest over there? I think so, Mongo. Let's go check in with the guards. Uh, hello, guards. Can we please, please, please just go to our treasure now? Yes, Wudo and Mongo, you have successfully completed the circle challenge. Oh my gosh, Mongo, no way. We did it. We can 
finally get our treasure. Wait, we're not dying if we leave the circle? Let's go. Finally, Mongo. Can you believe it? We survived all this in just three days in this tiny circle. So can we please just open this chest already? Okay, Mongo. Let's do it in three, two, one. And oh my gosh. It's all the diamonds I've ever wanted. Let's go. It was all worth it for these diamonds, Woodo. I had so much fun. And do you know how the viewers can have even more fun, Mongo? By watching the video on screen, of course. Make sure you watch the video on screen if you want to watch another super fun adventure with me and Mongo. Bye!